Joe, I want to talk to you. There's a COVID-19 package, relief package, working its way through the General Assembly this week. Yeah, the North Carolina uh, General Assembly was scheduled to come back to town for what's called the short session, the second year of our biennial budget uh, on April 28th. Uh, it turned out that that was a necessary date for the legislature to deal with some things specific to the pandemic. And the decision was made by legislative leaders that they would limit the focus of the session that started on the 28th just to those things associated with uh, the coronavirus. Uh, the House had put together a relatively deliberative process, had been meeting uh, using telelinks with special committees focused on program areas that they felt as a result of the virus. The Senate chose not that approach, but of the three and a half billion dollars that the federal government's made available to North Carolina, the House and Senate came up with packages. The Senate's version of that was slightly less generous, started in at one point two billion. The House a little, a little more than that, one point seven billion. And the governor, of course, had weighed in with his recommendations at about one point four billion dollars. The various ways that portion of the federal money should be spent. Uh, the House has a version of it. The Senate has a version of it. They differ somewhat. Uh, one of the more notable differences is a division that's been in existence for a while between the House and the Senate. And that's about Medicaid expansion. The House believing that to help people that fall into a certain gap within uh, the available services within Medicaid in terms of their income and eligibility. Uh, the Senate still feeling as though the direct payment to medical providers is enough to cover the cost of those uninsured individuals who need treatment as a result of COVID-19. Uh, the House and Senate both agree on a number of other things, practical matters, extending certain deadlines, given the fact people let me, let, let me, let, let me uh, go money to, for additional needs like human services. 